guys these are my lipsticks here so i'm going to declutter this ones and this ones right here on this box these are the lipsticks that i already get rid of in this containers right here and these are the color pop well, the color pop these are like from 2015 2016 one and this one um, I just like wanted to get rid of this because of the um, they are very uh, dry for me and it does have a little bit of tint in them but doesn't moisturize my lips that much one of them is just this one this is the next um, lingerie and this is in the shade of exotic and this one is an old one. I did use this one around 2016, so that's why I'm getting rid of it because I have another one here, which is this one. This is a new one, and I open it to use it. And yeah, and this is one of my favorite um, shade or color. I'm going to set this one at the floor so that I can manage to get rid of some of the lipsticks that i don't want it in this collections because i already have some new lip products to store on this area now we're on the floor and i'm going to show you guys these are the ones that i'm going to get rid of so this ones right here are some lip glosses some lip balm um lip tint so yeah this ones right here So I'm just gonna go one by one. So this one is AOA Studio. I have two of them. I really like using this one, but I don't wanna um, use them at all now because they have a nasty stuff inside of it. And I'm not, I don't know. I'm just gonna go buy them again and use them as it is because I did use them whenever I top coat my lipstick and look at it, guys. They have something in their inside and it looks like it looks like they have a nasty stuff in there so I don't want to use them so I'm going to get rid of this and then this one I'm going to get rid of this because it doesn't work and it's not that much rough sugar they did use on this one although it smells good but it's not it doesn't work for me so I'm gonna, and this one I'm going to keep because this is the only lip tint that I have and my friend gave it to me this is the e to the house their dear darling tint and then this one is my favorite one and this is i think this is the fifth one that i did use on this revlon matte balm and this is the shade of it i use this a lot when i went to school and at work because the shade of it it's simply it's not that too much so it's just like a cool tone one so and this is my favorite one so I keep it and then this one is a lip gloss from um, I bought this one in the add-ons in the ipsy glam bag I'm not sure which one but yeah I've got this one for three dollars and this is the Bell and Argent and I like this one because it's red lips or red lip gloss you guys can see so I'm going to keep this one that and then this one I love using this one too and the smell is it reminds me of my my um, childhood I don't know why but I like the smell and I like the shade of it so I'm gonna keep it and then I'm going to get rid of this because it's too dry although I like the smell of it because it, it does have mint in it but it's too dry for me I'm gonna throw it away and then I'm going to keep this one. This is the Paris Ink Velvet. This is the Peri Peri one. And this is like a kind of hot pink color. And as you can see. I'm going to keep this ones as well. So I'm going to put this back on right here. So these are my maybe pile one so I have three in here 
and I already get rid of four of them right here. So I'm going to put it right here. So the next one's right here. next one these are like liquid lipsticks from drugstore or from a high-end brand so these are my Maybelline Superstay matte ink and I have four of them so far I have the ruler Amazonia Voyager and protector and this is the darkest one the darkest shades that I have in here and my favorite one right now as of now is this one this is the ruler this is the ruler the protector the voyager and amazonian are these ones i'm going to keep this ones these are the healthy lip from um physician's formula i only have two of them unfortunately and this one is um five free radicals and this is my favorite shade and the formula is very smooth and comfortable and the next one, I always use this one whenever I go out right shade lipstick on my lips. So here it is. As of now, you guys, if you always watch my videos, I always wear either this tone, this tone, or that tone. So yeah, I like this kind of mauve color shades from lipstick. So mauves and nudes and some red lipsticks are my favorite thing. And then, as you guys know, this is my new West Next Lingerie, and this is in the shade Exotic. And you guys will probably know it's going to be like the same shade right here, although this one is a little bit warmer compared to the Physician's Formula right here. I'm going to keep that. I'm going to keep this one because I like this lip plumping from elf too this is only five dollars so i'm going to keep that and then i'm going to keep this three as well because i love the formula of this um Rimo london yeah this is Rimo london i love Rimo london's lipsticks because they are like too bright and i love the brightness of them and then i'm going to keep this one because this is huda beauty and i think this is the only lip products that I have in my collections and then I'm going to keep this one as well this is the lingerie also from NYX Cosmetics it's in the shade of Cabaret and then I haven't used this two yet but I'm going to keep them because I like the shades of this two and this one is going to be in the maybe pile because I don't like the shade of it because it's too bright, but I like the formula of it. It's too watery, but yet it looks like a lip tint. You guys can see it. So I'm going to keep that. And then for this one, I'm going to put it in the maybe pile because I don't like the shade of it. and But it's a tart one, so I don't have any tart product yet so i'm going to put in the maybe pile and then this one is one of my favorite one this is the dose lip crayon and this is like kind of what do you call this this is like winterberry and i love using this one whenever i go out to do errands because it's easy to glide in my lips and then for this ones, these are the only lip products or lip pencils I do have in my collections. And this one is the color pop one, NYX Cosmetics and John Deep Blue and Huda Beauty and Maybelline Sensation one. So I'm going to get rid of this one because it's not my favorite kind of shade color. So I'm going to get rid of this. So I'm going to put this back on. So 
So the next one's right here. I'm not going to get rid of any of this. Although I'm going to show you guys. These are my ColourPop collections. These are either cream or matte formula. I haven't had their blur once because I stopped buying of their products because they release so much of their collections that I can keep up on their products. So favorite one here is um, Foolish and on display. Although all of these are my favorite colors, I always use them whenever it, it depends on my mood. So yeah, and then I'm going to put this back. And then at the back, I have these two face here. And I only have the Muy Caliente and he's with me. These ones are my favorite color too because it's red. It's like a different shade of red. You guys can see. And I love the smell of this. It's very peachy, um, kind of peachy. And it does have some of other substance in here that makes it more smell good. So I'm going to keep this one. Plus the packaging is totally great, superb one. And I went to DJ Max last time, but it was, unfortunately, I didn't see some of them of this ones already i think they ran out or they're not in tj maxx anymore so unfortunately i only have two of them but hopefully i will see some of the other shades in there in the future and it's only like 6.99 compared to buy it in sephora which is like 20 dollars or 21 so you save a lot and then this ones right here are like sephora uh, this is their lip stores i only bought two of them because i just wanted to try their uh formula and these are both creme yeah i think these are both creme and i like the packaging and they're too small and you just can just pop it up in your uh purse and this one is the i think this is the berry licious yeah this is the berry licious and this is this and this one is the cash money so i always use this one whenever i like the green color because <laughs> my favorite color is green so i just put it because i like green and then it reminds me of rihanna <laughs> that's why and next one i have this one this is the bare minerals bare minerals and it this one is the in the shade of naughty oh my god and slay I always use this one because I like the formula and this one is a little bit too bright but I think it's okay as you guys can see here it's not too bright but it's like it does have like the pop off color compare it to this two this one is a little bit darker red I'm sorry guys if I have like a difficult to talk because I have colds and cough and this one is a little bit lighter compared to my liking but i will keep it because it's like collection ones and they have this small collections so it's easier to put them in the purse so i'm going to fix this so it feels like this one is my luxury cabinet or storage although they're not really luxury one but it looks like luxury because of the packaging I'm going to clean a little bit right here. This one, it doesn't move. It's like a lip stain. And then, of course, the super stay are really super stay. <laughs> so next one's right here. This is the fourth one. So some of them are already expired because I love Maybelline lipstick products. So. First of all, for this four, I'm going to get rid of the Divine Wine because this one is already expired. So I'm going to throw this away over there. I'm going to keep this three because these are new. Oh no, this one is Espresso. 
going to get rid of this too because it's expired i think i got this one in 2016 and it's already 2019 so i'm going to get rid of it and this one it's burgundy and i'm going to get rid of this one because it's already expired this one keep keep this too because they're new these two are old so i'm going to get rid of them and this one is new and this ones here are from elf they are new so i'm going to hey bro go over there oh what now go over there go over there sit over there please i'm almost done baby girl come here Sit next to me. Sit. What's wrong? Oh, baby. Come here. Sit, sit, sit. Sit. Good girl. I'm almost done. So I'm going to keep this for, I mean, this lip, these e.l.f. lipsticks. Because I love the formula of them. So I'm going to keep them right there. So I'm going to put this back. And I did get rid of, I did get rid of five of the Maybelline right here. So I'm going to throw this away because they are expired. So the last ones right here, I'm not gonna get rid of any of them because these are metallics. And I love metallic lipsticks. So I'm going to keep them here for now. This one is right here and I'm going to throw this here so I'm going to keep this one the Kat Von D one because these are new and my friend gave this to me so I'm going to keep this ones they are mini lip stick liquid lipstick from Kat Von D I'm going to keep them and I'm going to get rid of this because I don't use them so yeah and then I'm going to get rid of this because I don't like the shade of it. I bought it because it's blue. But it does have that... Um, how do you call this? It's like not really full blue color. So I'm going to get rid of it. And then I'm going to get rid of this too because it's already old. I got this one in 2017 and I don't use it at all. So I'm going to get rid of it. And then I do have one right here. This is the Laritzi. I've got this on my Ipsy Glam bag, so I'm going to keep it. And then these three, I'm going to keep them because I love the shades of this. And this is our Nabby one. And I'm going to keep all of this right here because these are my new ones. These are my new ColourPop lipsticks at once. So these are the shades that I love in ColourPop lippy sticks. And this one's right here, this is our the AOA Studio ones. And it's like a dollar each from Shop Miss A. And I'm going to get rid of some of them. So I'm going to keep this too. I'm going to get rid of this light color. And then and then I'm going to get rid of this too because it's too light. So I'm going to keep seven of them. So I'm going to put them right here in case. Okay. Once it's here, I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to get rid of this too because they're already like dry. These are the next um, soft matte lip stick. I'm going to get rid of that. Then I'm going to get rid of this three because I don't really use them at all. Although. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them because they have this gray. This is the blue one. So I'm not sure yet. Oh. And this one is like off color. I'm going to keep this like maybe in the maybe piles. So the maybe piles are right here for now. 
And then I'm going to get rid of this one. This is the Rome one and I've been using this a lot before. So it's already expired by now or dry. So I'm going to get rid of it. And these are like more of butter gloss. So I'm going to keep them. And then these ones are new too. These are the Wet n Wild. The cat soup one. And then I'm going to keep this too because it's the Essence one. This is the only Essence lipstick that I own. Right there. And this is like, I think this is like affordable one. I think it's less than $3. And then this one is my favorite one. This is the Cans or Cons. But I think I'm going to get rid of it because it's already dry. I'm going to buy a new one. And then this two, I'm going to get rid of them. These are from Rimmel London. And this is already old shade and it's already dry. This is the Bordeaux, or Bur yeah, Bordeaux. And this one is the Kate one. This is the Zero One. These are my favorite shades from Rimmel London one. So yeah, I'm going to get rid of them because they're already old. I'm going to buy a new one. And then this one's right here. I'm going to get rid of this because I like the color of it, but it's still dry now because they're already old. So I'm going to get rid of this too. The next ones are this ones right here. This is from Clean Color. I just bought them because I wanted to try them. So I'm going to get rid of the um, lighter color. So this too. So I'm going to keep this. I'm going to keep that. I'm going to keep this because this color they're not my forte as you guys can see it will let my lips like a little bit darker if i'm going to use this ones so i'm gonna keep that i'm going to keep this one not this one i'm going to keep this too yeah i like this color Keep that. I'm going to keep this red because I love red. I don't know about this one though. Yep, I'm going to keep this. The only thing that is hard for this lipstick, they only have the numbers, they don't have the names. And I'm going to keep this one for sure. I don't know about this. I'm not gonna keep this. It's too light for me. Going for sure, I'm going to keep this too because I like this color. Oh, I like this one. Yep, I like this color. And this one, I'm not sure. Yep. I'm going to keep this. This is brown. I'm going to get rid of this too. I'm not sure about this one. Mm, no, I don't like it. I'm going to get rid of it. So this too. I'm not sure. Yep, I will keep this one. I like that color. But this one. Mm. Looks like poop on me. <laughs> Let me check again. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna keep it for now. So, I did get rid of this. So, 
I already get rid of 49 lipsticks or lip products. So, so far, these are the ones that I'm going to throw away. And here are the some of the maybe ones, which are this. So, two, four, six, eight. I have eight products here that is going to be on my maybe piles. I think that's it for you guys. I hope you guys like this video if you like this one. And I'm going to declutter soon some of my other makeup products so for now I'm going, I did declutter my lip products which is right here this is the newest one I still have some I have still a lot but I use them in my videos that's why and I do makeup pro I do makeup looks and makeup reviews so yeah it's okay to have a lot of these lip products but if you are a normal person, this is a little bit too much, but yeah, this is part of my work, this is part of my collections, and yes, I love the products as my collection, so bye-bye, thanks for watching.